Hello. So I'm going to be talking about um, funds for those in the community, you know, when people go real life on them and they might need to go legal or, you know, if something just happens, you know, uh, I guess you would say um, something, how should I put it? Um, just something happens in their life and they might need funds and you know how you know when people drop PayPal pools there just seems to be I don't know bad taste in people's mouth I don't know I don't even know why uh, because creators should be able to do that drop their own PayPal pools or PayPal funds or whatever and their communities be able to donate and not have an issue right but it seems like um, a lot of people have issues. I, I don't know why. Well, maybe we're not even going to go there. But anyways, I said I was going to do this video um, Monday. But I just, um, I had some things come up and I just couldn't. So I figured I'd go ahead and try to release this today. Um, I am doing some research. Uh, which I should have done a long time ago about going live, going on StreamYard, uh, doing all that good stuff instead of just doing pre-recorded videos all the time. Uh, that way I can get engaged with other people, maybe go on panels. Um, I just need to get off my butt and quit being lazy, right? So anyways, uh, while I talk about this, I am working on this other concrete project. Um, I decided not to film it because I've never done this before, for one. Um, two, it's it's taken a long time and it's gonna take a long time. I already said we have a lot of humidity going on. Um, and then we got uh, rain over the weekend. The whole weekend it rained. I was gonna go camping and didn't even get to do that because of the rain. And right now, I'm sitting in my grass and it. I just cut my grass a few days ago and it absolutely needs cut again but um, it is so hot on my deck the Sun I already uh, explained that on this side of my house the Sun just barrels down I have this one small tree besides what I call my Christmas tree that's in my little doggy area on the other side I have larger trees but I have my um, my patio over here where I normally do my concrete work I will not do it on my deck my patio I can just spray it off right um, I just restained my deck so I am not going to do any type of concrete work on my deck and I put my umbrella I have two umbrellas um, one that I normally put over like my hammock if I want to lay on my hammock and the other ones on my my table and I put those up thinking that it would block the sun and the sun is just still barreling down so I thought you know I'm just gonna get my yoga mat and just sit in the grass while I do this video and play with this concrete and just chat so anyways um, what I am attempting to make I'll go ahead and say it I'm attempting to make a fountain um, again this concrete is old it's not the best concrete. Um, I'll just kind of show you what I'm doing. Uh, this is the base. It needs sanded big time. I did not know if it was going to crack or what. It didn't. But it needs sanded. And I used... I um, don't know if you can see or not because the sun is still in my eyes. I don't know what you can see, what you can't see. But this was just something I got at Dollar Tree. I got a bunch of them to organize, um, organizing my cabinets. So I was looking, um, when I decided to try to do this, I was looking for like something round and a bigger, but I didn't want it too big because like I said, I didn't know if this would crack with the humidity, just like with my fire bowl or whatever, but um, it didn't crack, 
and it did leave these little ridge things. What I had to do, I had to tape the holes so that it didn't leak out. It didn't turn out the way I wanted it to, and, and I have a lot of sanding to do. But we're, we're just going to work with it. And then they had these at Dollar Tree as well. So the little bowls, um, they need sanded as well. I used these for the mold. And I put a hole in it before it dried and then cut out the little not notches for the water to come through. It's going to be a three-tier. So I have three of them done. And this extra one is just going to be for... Um, a plant to go on so anyways um, what I have to do now is I have to have I'm gonna move this out of the way because I gotta work on some more concrete here and I, I don't have the right tools to do anything so I just kind of made this up. This is going to sit on top of it for these bowls and stuff. And this is like the base that, that everything's going to sit on. And I, I'm just kind of eyeballing it on how big it should be. I don't know. So I'm just going to make some concrete up as I talk. And I'm going to pour it in here. And this might be, I might splice two videos together as I talk. Just kind of so you see what I'm doing too. And as the uh, day goes on, it's going to get hotter. And I don't know, I, I might take a break on what I'm talking to, you know, as I talk. And we'll come back because there's a lot to explain. So, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and, and just start talking about what my plans are and mix up some concrete. Like I said, I don't know if you can see or not because... I got my little tripod here and I, I just can't see what I'm doing. But what I am planning on doing outside of YouTube is start a store. Um, I just haven't decided if I was going to um, do it on eBay. I, well, I think I am going to do an eBay store. But I don't know if I'm going to do um, a store on Etsy as well or Poshmark. And uh, I just, I haven't decided yet. I haven't got that far. I haven't looked at, you know, the pricing on, you know, the different fees that they take out. I do know that I am going to go with eBay. And I think I'm going to go with Poshmark because of the items that I have. And I'm doing that off of YouTube. Um, I have, I've been wanting to do that for a while now, way before I even had a channel. Um, and the reason being uh, that I wanted to do that, I already said that I downsized my house. And I will be, be losing train of thought like normal, but even more so because I'm mixing up concrete. So I'm trying to multitask. Um, but I have, um, and, I, and I talked about giveaways, right? I also said that I wanted to do just to break up some, some drama, even though this is a drama community and we do like some drama, right? Um, I wanted to do some like game nights or just giveaways for no reason, right? Um, but I was going to, um, like I said, I, I did downsize and I have um, my, my daughter, I would say about maybe seven years ago. She, um, she's been lucky enough to, to be a stay-at-home mom, um, and because her, her husband, he works, and he has a very good job, um, but she decided recently 
that she was going to go back to work and go to college. Uh, since her youngest now uh, started school, she was, she's got four children. She decided, you know, she wanted to get out there in the world and do her own thing now. But when she was a stay-at-home mom, uh, strictly a stay-at-home mom, she uh, wanted to do, she wanted to do her own thing too, uh, maybe bring in a little extra income and just have a little bit of fun. So she started ordering um, some jewelry and some other things from a vendor. And I have to say, the vendor is not paparazzi. Nothing against paparazzi because I like paparazzi stuff. Um, but it's not paparazzi. And um, she... Uh, and this vendor, I, um, I even ordered stuff. Um, I mean... You might not see rings on my, my fingers because you just see my hands. You don't see my face or anything. But I do wear jewelry. It's just when I'm uh, doing a lot of different stuff, I, I you don't see jewelry on me a lot. But I do wear jewelry. And so I started ordering stuff too. But she would just, um, some of the stuff that she would, uh, the way that she would sell it is just on um, the local marketplace. But she, um, she at one time wanted to uh, do, she wanted to make her own website and start selling stuff. And like I said, I, I ordered a bunch of stuff and you get kind of caught up in the moment and you, you see stuff and you're like, oh, I, I, I want that, I want it. Or they, they sell it in bulk uh, and you get a good price off of it in bulk. And, um, anyways, that was short-lived. Um, she, she decided that she, uh, you know, was, I mean, she did really good. Uh, there was only really one thing that she really put on the, on the marketplace, one item, and that item really sold, um, really good. But I have to say, she, she just, uh, she gave me the rest of the stuff, and it, it's all brand new. Um, I ended up with, with all of the items. She's in a different state. And like I said, I purchased a lot as well. Uh, it's that impulse buy-in stuff. It's all new stuff. And when I say a lot, I have a big tote full of this stuff, and I've had it for over seven years yeah so maybe even a lo uh, little bit longer and I'm like what do I do with this um, my sisters have went through a lot of it and they have uh, gave it to you know people for Christmas and stuff like that I just you know would give it to them take it please um, a lot of uh, some of the well, uh, uh, some of the jewelry that's in there is sterling silver. Um, some of it's costume jewelry. So, anyways, um, I have that, and like I said, when I say a tote, I'm talking a big tote. So that's one thing that I have, and I'm just gonna dump this concrete in here. I wanted to make it a little thick and I'm going to have to go make some more. So I'll be right back. So I'm just mixing up some more concrete. Um, one of the other um, items she ordered uh, from this vendor and I did as well. Um, this is something else I forgot. She, she did uh, sell some of these and I did too because people were interested um, when they seen what she had I went ahead and I did sell some too uh, just because I had people asking me because I would post for her and they would ask me could you get this or get that 
and they were um, vinyl wall decals that you would put on your walls and I, I have to say too none of this stuff comes from Wish just putting that disclaimer out nothing against Wish I've never ordered anything from Wish um, I have heard some not so good uh, things about Wish uh, basically about their clothing um, that you order stuff and it's if you order large it comes like really 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 small so never ordered anything from Wish but um, anyways what this is is um, they're vinyl wall decals some of them have sayings on them others are like um, flower print some are for like nurseries or for kid rooms um, she did really good on those I forgot she did sell those too on the marketplace um, you can get them at Hobby Lobby they're very expensive at Hobby Lobby or Michaels um, but I also have a tote a big tote full of those yet like I said I've had this stuff for about seven years um, I have done nothing with them uh, as I have been going through more stuff you know it's like I, I have to do something like I said I was it, I, I have to do something um, and so that's another thing um, one of the other things that I have is I have a lot of designer purses um, what happened with that was and this has been oh goodness maybe eight years ago I went to it was a yard sale estate sale is where it first started and I, uh, it was another big tote, and it was full of purses. And this man kept putting more and more purses in there. I mean, he really wanted him to go. And um, I went ahead and I bought it. And they were designer purses. And um, on top of that, I picked some up as well uh, along the way. And my sister, bless her heart, she will, she's been picking them up here and there. Um, and she knew that I was going, that I was planning on starting a store at some point, like I said way before uh, I started my channel, and she knew what I was going to be looking for at some point, but I didn't need that many. And so she would pick them up if she seen them, and if she would get them for a decent price, um, and what I have is all authenticated. I, I think there might be uh, one that I have not got authenticated yet, but um, the rest of them are absolutely real. And there is no need for me to have all of these purses. Um, actually, the purse that I carry is just a plain Jane uh, off off brand it's it's uh, it suits me it fits what I need uh, it's not a, a name brand purse so anyways I have a lot of these purses okay so I thought, you know, it's time for them to go as well. And another thing my sister and I like to do, um, 
we like to go to uh, estate sales and I like picking up and, and so so does she and she, she'll go she lives um, and I'm just gonna spread this out I don't want this real thick I might have to make up another batch I'm not sure this isn't meant to be a, a thick piece I'm going to put this on pause while I really look and see at this because I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing here. One moment. Okay, so I have that ready, just kind of like a cake. I had to really look and be careful on how I did this. Don't know if it's going to turn out. I have no idea, and hopefully it's a lot thinner. Hopefully this humidity does not crack this. This is going to have to sit for a while. Um, I am going to go ahead and move this to let it dry. So I'll be back and then we'll chat a little bit more. Okay, now I'm going to try to attempt to make like a little lip thing here for water to go down on. I said this could be an epic fail I don't know so what I was discussing is my sister and I we like going to these estate sales sometimes just sales they might not even have to be estate sales and you might find some really nice uh, vintage pieces um, and I, I've really got into that and so I want to put that in my store as well now I have to say my my Taste though uh, has really changed because I'm into modern, um, but I'm starting to get into the vintage as well, and I'm kind of combining that uh, with my decor. If that makes any sense. Just like I used to be into neutral colors, and now I'm kind of popping colors. I'm kind of getting into the stuff that I would never get into before. You know, I, I kind of like staying with, you know, neutral, you know, just whatever. And now I'm just throwing splash of colors everywhere. But anyways, so I am, uh, we go a lot on the weekends and we go looking for stuff and I'm, I'm just picking up stuff here and there and, um, you know, at these estate sales or just regular sales, sales and finding out, you know, that a lot of the stuff are vintage or even if they're not vintage, but they're just really unique items. And um, so I want to put that, you know, some of that stuff in there too. And then uh, why I mentioned Poshmark is I have a lot of clothing, okay? Um, a lot. And I mean a lot, a lot of name brand clothing. Um, I have donated a lot of stuff too. I do have to say, I, I do donate. Um, and my sister, bless her heart, I, I call her a hoarder, but you know, I think I am too. And I even downsized. But she uh, has a basement. I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. I think you're supposed to wet this first, I don't know. But, um, she has in her basement she has three rooms and she has a lot of stuff um you know in my store too i have a lot of like kitchen gadgets some of the stuff is brand new don't ask me i i, I pick the stuff up and i'm like i'm gonna use this i really am it's cool i'm gonna use it it i never do um my sister and I both, too, will pick up stuff thinking that other people might, you know, maybe in the family will use it at some point. Um, and they just don't need it, already have it, or, or whatever the case may be. So, anyways, um, that's kind of uh, where I'm getting at and I am going to get that that store going and like I said I was going to do it off of YouTube 
anyways, um, I am just a procrastinator of it. And I do have a lot going on, you know, just like a lot of people out there. And you just, I don't know, you just, you know, you just don't get to what you're doing. You know, I, I this just doesn't want to stick. Um, you know, I know a lot of people do crafts, uh, some creators, they do crafts and they sell their crafts and stuff um, as a business too, as well as you know, their YouTube channel. There's nothing wrong with uh, trying to do an income or an extra income or with whatever with your talents. There isn't. But um, I thought about, like I said, you know, with uh, doing the clothing line as well. And yeah, so anyways, um, I just know that I've been putting off what I wanted to do, what I was planning on doing for far too long and it needs to be done, you know, even if I don't put a link up on my channel page, um, you know, for my store, however I decide to do my store. I know I'm pausing a lot. Um, it still needs to be done because, you know, I, I do need to get rid of this stuff. And if I can go ahead and make a profit off of it, then I'm going to do so, right? I'm going to do so. But I'm going to put this on pause again. I'm going to work with this a little bit. Uh, I'm really losing my train of thought trying to talk and, and trying to figure this out. And this is going to harden up and I'm not going to be able to do it. So let me see if I can at least do one of these little puppies and try to figure out what I'm doing. Okay, so I think that's about how we want it. I think the water can come out of that pretty well, maybe. I don't know if you can see. So I'm gonna um, I'm gonna do the other two and just take a little breather here, and um, then we will come back and I will talk a little bit more. Uh, yeah. So, anyways. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about what I'm going to be doing and I can, you know, get some input, not get some input. We'll just talk about a little bit more, but uh, I'm going to get these other two ready and this will dry pretty quick and then it all needs sanded. But as you can tell with these bowls, I was able to get this little um, ridge. It would have been nice to get that little design right there. I did try to begin with. I tried to do the concrete um, on the outside to see if I could get that shape or the little design and it broke. I just tried to um, pat all this on there on, on top and it broke. Like I said, I am working with old stuff so um, I'm just trying to use it up and chit chat here. So I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of these. Take just a little bit of breather and we'll come back because I do have to, um, I have to work on that slab and I'm really afraid with it being so thin that it is going to crack on me with the humidity. Luckily, with this and uh, the fire bowl I made, since it's so thick, it didn't crack. Like I said, I have a lot of sanding to do with this. Um, I don't know. We're just going with it, just playing. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other ones, like I said. And then we'll come back and I'll do some more talking about, you know, what I'm planning on doing. So I'm back. Um, I had to wait until this cured a little bit before I'm doing what I'm doing. I know it looks like a hot mess. 
<laughs> so what this is, this big one, I already did it. Um, this is going to be the first tier that's going to hold the little bowl. And it's going to hopefully <laughs> drip into this and then down to this. We'll see. But um, I had to let this cure and it was just, it was hot anyways. And I, like I said, I don't, I don't have what I need. So I just basically went with what I had around the house. They had some Mountain Dew uh, con containers, whatever um, Mountain Dew comes in, 12 pack. Um, I cut those up. I wanted this to be square and I don't think it's gonna be but I did this one up this is kind of where I wanted to sit and so far this one's holding all the concrete and I just took some duct tape some black duct tape from Dollar Tree my go-to store and so far this is holding the concrete in we're gonna do this one and yeah so I, I just took a break and let the sun go down um, and also I was sitting out here while I was doing the the taping of these uh, the neighbors were going crazy uh, the kids were f-bombing the parents came out and f-bombed someone stole someone's phone uh, so yeah it's kind of quiet now but you, if you hear it I apologize um, but anyways so um, this is one of the bowls the, the little lips like I said it's uh, it's dry but with the humidity it there or the heat or whatever it's drying pretty fast but it's really got a horrible texture to it but I'm gonna sand it really good and again it's old old stuff that I'm using but I'm experimenting now I really don't know where I left off and I'm just gonna I'm gonna mix up some more concrete and fill this up and that's about all the concrete I'm gonna do except tomorrow I'm gonna put like a little border around this thing and then that will be it um, and then I'll do some sanding and we'll see um, so what I was talking about, while I mix up some concrete here, I was talking about um, the store that I'm going to do, and I was just kind of giving the background of some of the things I have, and I'm going to, you know, do some research on eBay, <coughs> dust is coming up from this stuff. Um, eBay is one I know for sure. Etsy I'm not sure about. Um, Poshmark uh, possibly. Uh, I just I'm not sure. Um, and I did say I was talking about my sister and I lost my train of thought but I was telling you that she has a basement. She has three rooms down there. I think two bedrooms and another room or whatever and she's just she's got it's full full of stuff and um, I was telling you that you know we like going to estate sales and I like um, I pick up stuff and I was picking stuff up you know uh, a while back when I was thinking about doing this store uh, online store or whatever and I just you know never got around to it and we we still do that um, I just find some really uh, unique items um, I'm also going to uh, do toys too I think I'm um, just unique toys I I don't know um, I have some stuff um, my grandkids are all in Tennessee, so uh, I'm thinking about incorporating that too. I don't know. This is just uh, the beginning stages. Like I said, I should have done it a long time ago. But now that I have a channel too, 
I thought about uh, maybe possibly dropping my link to my store once I get it going. I haven't really decided if I'm going to do that or not. It's an idea. I, I just, I don't know. But once I've seen all of what is going on, this is where I was talking about uh, helping out the communities. I've said it many times, I don't have a community. I, I don't want, um, I never wanted a community of my own. Uh, everybody that comes here belongs to other communities. But what I'm seeing is a lot of people having issues with others going real life on them. And everybody knows I'm not okay with that. I don't care who you are. I don't care, you know, it, it doesn't matter to me who you are. When someone is going real life on you, that's not okay. It's not. And I already said that until somebody is held accountable legally, in my opinion, it's not going to stop. It really isn't. And so my thinking was um, with my store, and even if I don't put uh, my link on, on my page, okay, or on my channel or whatever, I'm still going to do it because I think it's important. Um, if somebody is needing funds, okay, um, to maybe go legal on somebody that is going real life on them. And, you know, like I said, they can drop, you know, PayPal's or whatever, uh, and, and that's great. But uh, sometimes it is hard to raise the funds that they need even when they drop their PayPal links, right? Or their PayPal pools or, or whatever. It might be hard because, you know, times are hard out there. It is. So I'm going to do it one way, you know, either way I'm going to do it. Um, with my store, when I get it up and running, okay, I am going to set aside a percentage and I'm not sure what that percentage is going to be. Um, I have no idea. And people can give me some input on what they think. You know, if they think uh, no, it's a bad idea, uh, no, we don't, we don't care, you know, whatever. You're welcome to your opinion, but I'm still going to do it. I'm going to set aside a percentage for people in this drama community, this drama circle, because I am a part of it now. Um, I'm going to set aside a, a, a percentage just for people in this community if they are in need for, like if someone goes real life on them and they need to go legal. And, um, you know, it, it, it might not add up a lot to a lot. It, it just depends on how my store goes. Like I said, um, even if I don't even if I don't um, drop my link, or drop my store on, on um, what do you call it, on my channel, um, my family and friends on Facebook, and it's going to be, you know, if I go with eBay or Poshmark or whatever, it's still going to be on there. So I don't need my channel per se to get any traffic to my store. So, you know, um, I can advertise in other ways, but I'm still going to set back a percentage and I'm not sure what, but it's going to be a percentage to go towards the community. Like I said, if somebody is going real life, you know, if they have a situation and they need legal funds and, and they, they just need that help, or like I said, if um, not only that, stuff happens in life, 
It, it does. If there is a situation, and I'm going to go ahead and start filling this up. If there's a situation, um, an issue, a tragedy, or, or whatever, somebody needs help in this drama circle, okay? Um, stuff happens. I get it. I absolutely get it. And they might uh, need help. And like I said, they can drop uh, their PayPal link. Um, and, you know, their, their community can donate. And that's awesome. But this is going to be also for that as well. I can set aside a percentage from my store to help and I can donate you know um, to people in this community and when I say community I, I'm talking about this this drama circle okay this drama circle drama am I saying that right this because it's a it's not just one community, it's a lot of communities, if that makes any sense. Um, and the reason why, uh, you know, if I do, if I do post my link, like I said, um, having the PayPal pools are great. I just figured, you know, um, having a, a product because a, a lot of people, you know, they do donate out of the goodness of their heart and they like their creator and stuff like that. Um, I just figured, too, you know, having a, a product um, might help uh, or, you know, I don't know. I don't know if um, or if somebody is, I don't know if, it, if they want to do a fundraiser. For, for somebody or, you know, they know somebody that, you know, they, they have a, an animal that, that needs surgery or, or whatever. And if they ask me if I, you know, have some stuff that I want from my store that they, that I want to donate, uh, to do auctions or, or whatever, if I'll donate it to them, uh, so they can have an auction instead of just people donating, uh, money, because sometimes it's hard to raise the money, I don't know if people understand what I'm saying, but if um, you have a product, instead of just donating, maybe people are more apt to, uh, to donate more if they're getting a product too. Um, I don't know if that makes any sense. I'll be willing to do that as well, you know, to donate some of my items to somebody. But it all has to be legit. It really does. Um, so that, that's another thing I was thinking about too. You know, um, say for instance somebody, you know, they want to, um, like I said, they know somebody that has, if you can see that, trying to get the, concrete up there seems like it's holding okay um say that they they have an animal that they're trying to raise funds for um and they they post their paypal link or if they ask me you know can you would you mind donating some of your items because i got a lot guys i got a lot would you mind donating some of your items and you know maybe I don't know if it goes against TOS. I have no idea if auctions or selling things on uh, channels, if it goes against TOS or not. I have no idea. I know some creators do sell things um, on their channel. But, uh, there we go. Um, but if they ask me, I'll be more than willing to do that, uh, to donate some of the items I have to them. 
so that they can hold auctions if they're wanting to do that, if they know that it doesn't go against TOS and if they want to do that on their channel. I have no problem with that. It's helping others out, right? Um, that's about it on what I'm going to do tonight. Uh, that filled up pretty good. It's holding its shape okay. We're just going to let it sit right here in the grass. I didn't move anything uh, back to my patio even though the sun is down right now. I just, I wasn't going to. But anyways, um, I don't know. I've been thinking about this for a while when all these, you know, going real life stuff is happening. And, and I have seen, you know, people, they are having some issues you know, in real life as well, you know, some hardships and stuff, and I'm just thinking to myself, if I got the means, uh, you know, a different way of, of helping out, you know, why not, why not, um, that's what it's all about, you know, I do it in real life, so why not do it on my channel, and I will say that everything, um, there, there will be transparency because I, I don't like this no transparency. So, um, everything will, you know, there will be transparency. And if anybody, you know, does need help and I, I do donate or whatever, um, or I donate funds to somebody, I will say that I myself will take care of the taxes Okay, uh, I'll, I'll, however it works or whatever, I will cover the taxes. I, I don't know how that all works, um, but I will make sure because when you're needing the help, right, it, whether it, it is to go legal or if you're having an issue, Whatever it may be, because I'm going to have to pay taxes anyways when I uh, do my store <clears throat> on all that. Um, I'll have to get with my accountant and, and find out all that good stuff as well. But that's the last thing you need to worry about too is, you know, the taxes on top of that. So I will take care of the taxes. So what I'm going to be doing... Um, is I'm going to be showing some of the items on my upcoming videos. I am still doing my series, um, but I'm going to be showing some of the jewelry that I have, some of the purses, um, some of the wall decals. That might be a little hard to show, but I am. Um, just it, maybe some of the uh, vintage items that I've picked up. Just kind of a, a few things that, um, just some of the few things that, that I have that I'm going to be putting in my store. And again, it's, it's a process. I, um, I have bought off of eBay before. I have never sold on eBay and it's been a while since I've bought on eBay. <clears throat> I bought off of Amazon a lot, but not off of eBay. So we'll just have to see um but i'll be like i said on my next uh videos that i do besides my series we're gonna show i'm gonna show you some of the products that i have um like i said you know it, it even if people think oh that's a horrible idea i'm still gonna do it w what is it gonna hurt it's not taken away from anybody else right um I'll just put the money aside and if I see somebody that uh, is in help I'll I'll reach out to them and say hey you know there's no strings attached absolutely none there's no agenda I don't belong to any community there's places I chat there's people that I feel comfortable with um, so that's where I go so if you want to say that I'm in a community, well, I, I guess you can, but um, there's no agenda behind it. It's just, you know, being kind, helping others out. There is no agenda. 
um, like I said, even if I don't put my link um, on my channel, I'm going to be doing this outside of YouTube. So I'm still going to be putting a percentage back just for the community, uh, this drama circle community. Anyways, in case I see that uh, some help is needed. Now, what I won't do, and I will say this, what I won't do is help those that go real life. That I won't do. I won't help those that I know are going real life on other people because I am so totally against that. So if they're known to go real life on others and then they have an issue, I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm not going to help somebody that is vile like that. But um, those are the only ones I won't help. Anybody out, you know, everybody else, I, I don't care, you know, what community you're in. I don't care, you know, um, who you, who you are loyal to, who you follow. That does not faze me. I, I don't judge people off of, you know, who, whose community they're in. You know, I'm not supposed to judge anybody anyways. That's, that's not uh, up for me to judge anybody. So that doesn't faze me one bit. Um, so with that, I am going to go ahead and go and uh, get inside. The bugs are now coming out. But I just wanted to put that out there. I'm, uh, like I said, um, my next videos, um, I will start showing things. I'm also going to be working, I promise, on my live streams. Um, I was looking it up a little bit last night, late last night, on uh, getting that to where I can go live. All the know-hows to do that. And I am going to, uh, when I finish this, there's only a little bit, yeah, well... I guess there's a lot more I got to do to this, but I'm going to do a short video when I get this done. And we're going to see, um, I got a pump. Uh, yeah, I am going to sand it and I am going to paint this because it's going to look super ugly. I think being natural, but it might look super ugly painting and it might look super ugly anyways. I don't know. We're just going to see. But anyways, that is what my plan is. Some might think it's just a horrible plan, stupid plan. Um, but I'm going to do it regardless, okay? Um, I'm going to have those funds put back. Like I said, I don't know the percentage yet. Um, one thing I'm not going to do, not going to do makeup, guys. Nope, it's not going to happen. <laughs> so there will not be any makeup. Now, I am also going to do, I already said, I'm going to do giveaways. Once I start going live um, and I do the game nights and stuff, and everybody is welcome. I don't care who you are. Uh, if you just want to get away, you know, from the drama, I'm not sure. Um, I'm an 80s girl, so I would love to do some, like, 80 music trivia or, you know, movie trivia or, or whatever I don't know I'll get some ideas but I'm gonna do you know giveaways and some of the giveaways will be some of the jewelry um, some of the purses um, some of uh, you know some of the things that I'm gonna be showing you some of those are gonna be giveaways um, and I don't know how often we'll do the giveaways the jewelry will be more giveaway uh, the only time that I will maybe do makeup or maybe it will be because um, I am really big on Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret lotions and sprays. Um, I might do like a, a bundle of like, you know, makeup and Bath and Body Works or something like that. But it would only be for giveaways and it would never be um, opened up 
okay? But it would just be giveaways, never ever um, for sale, uh, never opened up, used, or anything like that. Um, but that would only be uh, giveaways. Um, you know, like, I've, I've seen people, you know, way back that said that they wish that they, you know, could get some makeup, but they just couldn't afford it. And, you know, this has been a while back. I've seen it in some chat. So, you know, maybe like a, um, you know, in a giveaway one night or something, maybe a, a, a basket of goodies, you know, a big old truck going by. Traffic has been really interesting today. So maybe a, a, a basket of goodies, you know, one night or something like that. That would be the only time that I would ever uh, do any type of makeup. Uh, but there will not be any type of makeup in, in my store ever. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and go. Um, I started a new series on, um, shoot, I don't think it's on Netflix. Um Hulu, I, I don't know what it's on, but I'm going to get in and I'm going to watch it. Um, I have to work tomorrow. I don't even know when this is going to get released. I might not even release this video until tomorrow because I still got to upload it to my gallery and then to YouTube. So who knows when it's going to get uploaded. So anyways, I'm going to go. Everyone have a great evening and I will get to those videos where I'm going to be showing and it's going to um, one day I'll show the jewelry, the next day I'll show some purses, um, the next day I'll show something else. Um, so, you know, so it, it's going to be each day I'll show something different. But um, I don't know how soon. Yeah, I might get to some of it uh, this week, hopefully. And I'm still, like I said, I am still searching on you know, the best stores and stuff like that. So anyways, I'm talking in circles, losing train of thought. It's time for me to go in. I'm just going to let this sit and we will catch you on this little project again. I'll do a little video after I get it all picked up and it's done. We'll see it's a, if it's an epic fail or if it actually works and if it looks like something. So everyone have a great evening and I'll talk to you again.